Hey folks, welcome back to Natural Magic Building. I have some stuff to do. Um, down in the kitchen. Hey Elvis, how you doing? Yeah, he still has his nose. Uh, the court wizard over here. I don't think his has... No, his has grown back. Okay. Yeah, I've kind of been uh, um, relieving villagers of their noses. Because I can and because it's funny. <laughs> okay, um, let's see. What was I gonna do? I was gonna... Okay, so, um, last time on survival, uh, I, I was dinking around with Erebus stuff, and I made the keystone, but I didn't really know how to do the thing. So I looked up how to do the thing. Um, we're not gonna do the thing in creative, but this is, this is how you Erebus portal. I have not been there yet, so we're just gonna close that door. Uh, but what I wanted to do today was to, um, let's see, uh, do I want to put the floor in the kitchen, or do I want to uh, fix up the constabulary here, or, or, do I perhaps want to do something completely different? I think, um, because this was going to be the media room, because I think I've already got a... Yeah, no, not not this one? Oh, no, not this one. This one? Yeah. <laughs> I, I caved, I made an impulse buy, I bought a note block from Elvis out there. That was before I got my own pet, Elvis. Okay, so, you know, I think, um, I think instead of just wandering off and starting new projects, Willem and Nillum, I think I'm gonna finish up the kitchen today. I will finish up the kitchen, and I need to do something with this hall, because this is awfully boring. Okay, um, for a kitchen, I like a checkerboard floor. So I want to get a quartz block, and uh, yes, red quartz is a thing. Instead of the normal black and white, I want to do a red and white. And I'm going to need, uh, no, um, we're there, we're, 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 we're no, that's a block. All right, the lamp will do. So let's replace all these with these. All right, hold that thought. Okay. So let's just uh, start popping out the floor here. And this is gonna take some time, so we'll we'll speed this up. Yeah, we're okay. Ah, oh, buddy. Hi. Hi. I love you. Alright, we don't need that. Nor do we particularly need that. So let's just put a floor under it. Hey, bud. What's up? Okay, this is gonna get a little tricky here. No, it's not. There we go. So many villager noises in the castle now. Yeah, after I discovered, well, after I uh, spent diamonds or emeralds or whatever it was on villager eggs, yeah, it turns out all I have to do is just cut their noses off and plant them. Yeah. And, you know, they whine about it for a little while, but they get over it. You know. It's just a nose. Whoops. Okay. We'll, we'll put that there. Why not? Okay. Yeah, a little bit of that cave that we lit up. I still see. There we go. Alright. Oh, shoot. Oops, no, no, no. Okay. No. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Oops. So yeah, I now have uh, all kinds of happy villager noises 
happening in the castle. It's great. And, you know, if they step out of line, I just take a pair of shears to their nose and... Yeah. <laughs> Let's see what else is going on. Oh, yeah, the... Uh, I looked up how to fossil. So that's another thing we're going to be playing with, uh, I guess, when I get tired of the Erebus. We will, we will learn to fossil. Apparently, uh, long story short, TLDR, the culture vat, uh, is what I need to stick the dino DNA in. I also need to stick a lot of meat into it. Oh my god, dude, quit. I uh, also need to put meat in it. Or I think eggs is the other thing that works. But uh, it needs some kind of modern DNA in order to breed that dinosaur DNA into actual viable... Alright. Critters. Yeah. So you either get an egg or you get an embryo that you can uh, shoot up another mammal with. Yeah, um... Kind of some mad science crap going on here, but you yeah, know. It's fun. Uh, what? Go there. Red, go there. Okay. No. Oh, God. Okay. Almost done. And I'll, I'll do this even though it's invisible. Because, you know, because. Oops. Okay. Almost done. Oops. Okay, and I need to put a, um, put a light in there. Anywhere else? Nowhere else. Okay. Yeah, fortunately the herb farm seems to have taken care of a great deal of the lighting issue. Okay. Okay. I've got I moved the trash can over here. I still see no need to put in a refrigerator. Alright, but um this looks nice. Let's put in a little little breakfast nook. And we'll use I think we'll use a couch. We'll use a we'll make a booth. We'll do it like that. And we'll put... The, actually, no, we won't do it like that. That's ugly. Um, and, in, well, it's not that it's ugly. It's that it's entirely too fancy for what we're going to be using it for. But those are not fancy enough. Uh, seat. Just a nice little... Um, we'll just use uh, fur. Fur looks nice. Or mangrove. That's what I want. I want mangrove. And we'll just use uh, the little cheap seat back. Uh, buddy. Okay. No, 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 no. You don't need that. Here. Let's shine the dot on the ceiling. Freak him out. Maybe he'll go chase it. There we go. So I went to Ikea yesterday. <laughs> um with a friend of mine, and I actually got a nightstand because I needed a grown adult nightstand because I have been uh, basically instead using a uh, Rubbermaid container as a nightstand all this time. Oh, I need more of those. Okay. Mangrove? All right. Okay, and um, so yeah, we, we went there, and of course, you know, Ikea on Saturday is a nightmare. So she's like, do you want to do the whole tour, or do you want to just get your shit and get out? <laughs> so, <laughs> um, yeah, me uh, being the kind of shopper I am said, let's just get our shit and get out, and excuse my clucking there, but uh, you know. Do I need a tablecloth? I don't think I do. But I will uh, dye the seats. So, long story short, she got a dresser for the kids. I got a um, 
nightstand. And I brought the nightstand home. I had to put one of the cats in the bathroom while I put the nightstand together. Because he wanted to be all up in my grill. Much like he is right this minute. Okay, we can trap seven off now. And uh, that, that would have been dangerous to him because I was pounding nails into things. And it was, yeah. And I, um, let's see, uh, I almost put one of the drawers together backwards. I screwed one of the drawers into the nightstand onto the little rails and was so proud of myself for getting that done. And then realized I had put the top drawer in the bottom drawer slot. Elvis, what are you doing? Where are you? I thought he was still in here. Okay. Um, I don't know why I'm going. Where am I going? Why am I going there? Yeah, but, uh, you know, I, at least I didn't put it together completely backwards or anything. And that was fine. Um, what am I doing? I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Actually, I know what I need to do. Um, go on, buddy. Ouch. Get down. Uh, I need to name some... I need to put names on my uh, market stalls is what I need to do. And Coffee Hound had actually suggested some names earlier. Uh, hold on a second. I'm going to grab my tablet so I can look that up and get some signs. I'll be right back. Okay. Let's go and name some some market stalls here. All right. This one. Hi, buddy. How you doing? Outfitters. The blacksmith. Riddle of steel. Evie's Evs note block. Actually, I'm I'm gonna deviate just a little bit. Let's see. Um. <laughs> That's because he—it's it's more than note blocks. He's got records. He's got jukeboxes. He's got other stuff too. Um. Let's see. There we go. Sound shop. All right. Uh, and I'm gonna flex my little mental muscles here. Her. <laughs> okay. This guy. Butchery, I'm guessing. Uh huh, there we go. Uh, wait, I got a better one. Here's the beef. If you were alive in the 80s, uh, you probably understand the reference. Okay. Let's see. Um,. Stitch and Witch. And, uh, this... No, no, no. Oh, crap. Excuse me, um, Mr. Archaeologist person. Ah, uh, yes. Dr. Jones's... Tyno Depot. Okay, and I've still got a fix them up. Oh, uh, let's see. What else can I do right now? Um, I guess I could, uh, I'll decorate up the dino room a little bit. So, um, of course we are kind of, uh, starting to approach a point where we can see the end of this series. That being, once I get Castle Beef Knock completely built and furnished and play with everything that I want to play with in Natural Magic that's not in any other pack that I know of, at that point, I am going to move on to another pack. Now, I had mentioned Crendycraft. Oh, what is it that I'm looking for? Well, let's just pull up the whole mod, shall we? I had mentioned Crendycraft 
Um, oh, I think I have a trophy. Or a figurine or some crap. Chillin' over at the hovel. I have to go get it. Uh, I had mentioned Crendy Craft, and I I would still like to play with Crendy Craft. But, I, I'm also looking at some of the FTB packs. I've played Horizons in the past, and I may uh, pick one of the new Horizons packs to play with. Well, we might play with that some. Um, there's a couple other packs that I want to maybe take a look at. We might do a... Um, I, I might do a Beefnopolis After Dark, or two, or three. Just to play with some packs. That's not what I want. That's not what I want. Not what I want. Not what I want. Can I have a too high one, please? Oh, snap. Um... That's okay. I carry bricks around for that exact purpose. Oh my god. No. 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 Ah! No! Stop it. Oh my god, these things are going everywhere. Sorry. Sorry, I didn't mean to throw that out. Okay, fine. You know what? Just stay there. I don't care. Oh, that's lovely. Okay. Ah! Stop doing that. Okay, and I'll just uh, throw a couple more of these up. Ah! Oh my god! Stop it! Okay. That'll do for now. A little, little bit of that. And we need some kind of... Um, some kind of flooring material. Per iced stone... Paleo, paleo raft log. Ancient stone brick. Perfect. Uh, does it come in carved varieties by chance? I'm not holding my breath on this. Volcanic. Volcanic. More volcanic. Nah. It comes in smooth. It do not come in other funky bricks. Okay. Uh, apparently I might want to put the culture vat elsewhere. Because there is uh, some something about it failing and producing a failure saurus occasionally or creepers or um Pigmen, yeah, and I think that's not something that I want just chilling in the castle. I think I may need to move that somewhere else. We may need to make a dinosaur lab elsewhere. But for now, this will be fine. Oh, I never never finished my IKEA story. <laughs> so I got the nightstand. I got a lamp that was five bucks. Um, turns out it was five bucks because it didn't come with a bulb. But that's okay because I got bulbs. But uh, the whole point of the Ikea story was because my cat, both of them, have been taking turns sleeping in the box, this little tiny flat pack box that this nightstand came in since yesterday. And yeah, it's... Butthead has gone into the bathroom because he's being a butt and he's not cooperating. So unfortunately I've had to put him in the bathroom for a couple of minutes. But as soon as I'm done recording, I will let him out, give him many treats, and all will be well. All will be well. Okay. Pull that out from under there, and there, and there. Alright. Might as well just give me the builder's wand. Okay. Uh, I need lights. Are there any kind of uh, fossil lights. All this stuff here you make with pottery shards, which I don't have any, I don't really have enough of at the moment. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. In fact, I have at least one of these legit. So, um, I'm gonna pop these out. Yeah, there we go. That, that looks cool. 
And now I can't um, pop out the... Uh... Oh yeah, that, that's a problem. Um, I... Yeah, um... Give me one of these. Give me, give me a Kylix. That, that's not really what I was expecting. Uh, I was expecting like a stand type thing. Some sort of pedestal. We'll do this. We'll use the... Actually... Let's use some ancient glass. And put the lantern on top of that. There we go. That looks kind of cool. Oh yeah, that's better. Okay. I might, as I get more prehistoric stuff, I will play with this some more. Uh, I'm going to run out to the hovel real quick. Because I think I've got a figurine of some sort out there. i just throw that away. It is no good. Actually, I think I might, instead of that glass, um, use some chisel blocks. Alright. Yeah, just leave the door open. We're in creative. It's fine. Um, ah, there it is. Broken Enderman figure. Can these be repaired? Is the $64,000 question. Can they be restored? I want to say possibly on the workbench they can be restored. You know, I'm going to pop these out and face them out this way. Just because. Alright. Can these be restored? Uh, does not seem to be consuming the relic scrap or anything. So we'll just put that away for now. And... Find something cool to put stuff on. Hmm. Oh, there we go. Some pillar things. Not ice, though. That looks dumb. Um, maybe some moss stone. That looks prehistoric and stuff. There we go. Okay, and I'll put that there and that there. Oh, there we go. Actually, what if I put it... Can I not have it, like, facing up? You know what? It's fine. It's fine. It's fine like that. Alright, folks. I'm, uh, I'm gonna go do some work. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye. As long as, yeah, you're, you're gonna stop them. Before they get up those stairs. Oh, sorry, dude! Ah, oh, jeez. Oh, boy. Sorry. Sorry. Oh, boy. I, I'm so sorry.